Okay, I want to start off with, uh, with uh, my, one of my Russian friends who um, uh, put together a meter. So I want you guys to come on up here, the, um, the meter people. They have a meter to show you too. Yeah. And he's going to talk about it. He's got a small little meter. I, he put it on the computer for me. And, um, and you have to introduce yourself. And so like, I cannot pronounce your name, sorry. <laughs> Michael. Uh, Michael. It's Michael. For English, yeah. But, uh, you know, you don't say it in German. I mean in Russian. <laughs> um, anyway, he showed me the meter, and he put me on the meter, and I got the cans. And uh, what, what did you see on the meter? What was the needle doing? What was the needle doing on the on your meter? Oh, it's needle. It was what? Yeah. Right. <laughs> Hello. Uh, my name is Mikhail Fyodorov. I asked uh, Tatiana to translate uh, what I would say uh, into English. I would prefer to. Yes. Okay. Итак, ну россияне меня знают как Федора Михаила, вот, поэтому. Я думаю, что представляться не надо. Вот. И Татьяна будет переводить, я просил ее, так что вот она будет переводчиком. He said that uh, there is no need for him to introduce himself to Russians because they know him as Mikhail Fyodorov. And uh, he is going to be speaking Russian as he feels more comfortable with Russian. And I am going to translate. Okay. Uh, Ну, в первую очередь, почему я занялся производством метров? Я являюсь дипломированным радиоинженером. Вот я закончил Московский государственный технический университет по специальности радиоинженер. I have completed the Moscow Radio Technical University, and uh, I'm an engineer in radio. Uh, okay. uh, также uh, я являюсь профессиональным кодитором, я являюсь uh, КСом выпускника класса 4. И в какой-то момент я понял, что uh, я хочу для себя разработать такой метод, который uh, будет интересен именно мне и который будет полезен не только мне, но и аудиторам. And at some point in time, I realized, I realized that uh, I need an emitter that is going to suit my purpose particularly and uh, that will be helpful and fitting the purposes of other auditors. И uh, первое требование, которое я решил, uh, что должно быть для данного прибора, он должен быть uh, безопасным. Он должен соответствовать медицинским стандартам, то есть стандартам для медицинских приборов. And the first thing I was working on to bring the emitter up to the medical standards of safety that exist in Russia. There is a certain uh, standard. И второе требование. Он должен соответствовать стандартам для аудиторов, для профессиональных аудиторов, чтобы они могли это использовать в сессиях и чтобы это было удобное устройство именно и удобная программа для того, чтобы пользоваться именно профессиональным аудитором. And secondary, uh, it was uh, supposed to be uh, fitting the standards of auditing. Uh, it should fit the purpose of the session, so auditor can see all the reactions and can actually use it and work with it. И в результате получилось устройство. В течение последних трех лет было продано около 200 приборов, и половина ребят, которые здесь сейчас присутствуют, они пользуются именно этими приборами, когда они приехали сюда. Вот, и я считаю это своим успехом. And so I consider it my great success that I uh, success success okay. <laughs> that uh, I have created designed and created a, uh, machine, a device uh, that uh, uh, in the last three years uh, more than 200 uh, images have been sold and half of the Russians who are auditing they are using this emitter. I consider it very great success of mine. Uh, 
Поэтому, если вам интересно посмотреть на эти приборы, то, пожалуйста, подходите туда, я там буду сидеть с компьютером, и я вам покажу все, что есть э, на этом приборе. У нас есть три программы различные, вот, так что, э, добро пожаловать. I brought it with me, and you are very welcome to come uh, down to the last uh, table where I have uh, the imager to show you. It has uh, three different programs, and I will be more than happy to show them to you, to present them. Okay, thank you. Thank you. instructions how to set up drivers and uh, I think it's uh, very clearly to use uh, this emitter it not need instructions so easy I just show you how to work, how to work and I don't need uh, anyone who bought this emitter start to work even if he can't work at computer good yes it's really easy the main thing he has the instruction for setting it up to start to get it working. As soon as it's working, you you're not going to have any trouble. It's easy. Great. Does it have a name? Ah, yes. I uh, I call it theta meter. Theta. 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 Instead of measuring charge, it measures theta. Which is actually a charge is also theta. Interpolated, but theta. Okay. Any other questions? Okay. Good. Thank you. Okay. Did someone um thank you very much. Isn't that great? I, I, I got on the meter and, and it got reads, so um you showed an FN. So check it out. <laughs>